Hi. Hi, everyone. This is um, uh, the $5 fly tying station video 3.0. Uh, I started making these about a year ago uh, for uh, a class of kids during the pandemic. Uh, I was teaching fly tying and I wanted them to be able to take a kit, a fly tying kit home, and we learned how to tie flies uh, over Zoom. So they had to be able to go home. Well, you know, each kit can cost quite a bit. And I came up with approximately a $5 set that I can give the kids and they can take them home and keep them. Um, since that time, I've used it in a number of classrooms and uh, with adults too. In fact, tonight I'm teaching a class at our local library um, for fly tying and I'm using the kit. Um, uh, I've made some improvements over time and uh, I thought I'd come back with the, you know, with the, with the most updated version. Um, in this bag right here, this little bag, I have 15 fly tying stations. Uh, they come in a, I can just reach in, I pull out, and all my materials are in here too. But basically the whole kit is in a bag. Um, with all the tools and everything. And uh, so there's 15 of them in there, it weighs almost nothing. Um, and I can I can get around and it's not a big deal. If somebody says, you wanna teach a class? I can say, yeah, sure, I can teach a class. So here's the improvements I've made over time. Uh, the first iteration of the fly tying kit uh, was made out of a two by four, which still works fine but it was a little bit light and it would slide around on the tables a little bit. So what I did was I went to, um, actually I went to a store called Menards. It's a Midwest, basically Lowe's kind of a thing. It's more of a local Lowe's. And they had what were called uh, utility shelves, which I think were about, uh, I wanna say two foot by four foot long, uh, made of this sort of MDF material and they cost three dollars a sheet which was like super cheap and i was able to make i think about 15 or so of these units out of them they're approximately you know six inches long by maybe three and a half inches wide they're basically like a two by four uh, but what i did was i cut them in half and uh or i i cut the wood down to that size and because it was thinner uh, I just glued the two together. What that gave me was a much heavier base and it's a little rougher on the bottom. So when it sits on a table, it's not gonna slide around so much. So again, uh, what makes this a $5 kit is uh, the base is, the price of the base is under a quarter. Um, I buy these X-Acto knife things, 15 for around a 10 or $11 on Amazon. Uh, and the collet works perfectly to hold flies, all different strengths. And you can see that that's, a, that's on there as tight as you can be. Uh, these scissors are what are called nose clipper scissors. And these are under like a buck and a half, two bucks a piece. I use a straw as a, as a um, half hitch tool. I can buy the... Um, uh, the bobbins for about a buck a piece on eBay and um, or Amazon. And then uh, threaders, I have some that are made with just monofilament and some that are made with uh, very thin 013 uh, thousandths of an inch wire. Uh, and that works really well. So here's, so here's the whole kit, right? Here's the whole kit right here. So... Um, so we're all set, and uh, um, that's, that's, that's the whole kit as it comes. So that's the update on, um, on the fly tying kit. Uh, it, it's a whole lot cheaper than taking a whole uh, fly kit along with you. Uh, the other thing that I use a lot now is I, I bought this little video projector, and it slides up, and I can put that over the thing, and uh, that works really, really well. So that's my uh, getting around fly tying system. Uh, just recently, uh, I uh, 
just recently I did a, a, a workshop where we tied flies on the river. We sat down for a half hour, tied three or four flies, and then uh, went out on the river or went out on a pond and uh, caught fish with it. So it's a, it's a, it's a great way to be able to be mo mobile and uh, very, very inexpensive. I even gave people uh, the fly tying kits after we were done. So uh, for five bucks, you can, you know, any organization can be able to come up with that. So uh, everything's paid for by my lawn trout uh, fly casting stuff. So if you are interested in uh, helping out, uh, lawntrout.com is the way to go. So thanks a lot.